Hi, and welcome to Lippy Presents Ghost News Network. Today is our paranormal news and discussion, and we're going to be talking about the new news that they're making a new Amityville horror film. Uh, this new one, I believe, is a part of the Conjuring universe. Uh, the people who played Ed and Lorraine Warren in the first couple Conjuring films, as well as The Conjuring 3, which is also being filmed right now, is uh, coming out. Uh, they're working on that. They're going to be a part of it to play the role that Ed and Lorraine Warren played in the Amityville Hard, I guess, in, in reality, and so that's being filmed. Uh, what do we think, guys? What do we think about another Amityville Hard movie being made, and what do we think about it being tied with this whole Conjuring universe? I think what they, what they really need to do with the Amityville is take the Hollywood out of it and stick to the facts. Right. I think they should interview as many people as they can that were actually there. Not the aftermath. I'm talking like the people that were there. Right. Um, obviously, if you can contact the Lutzes, talk to each one of them and get their story. And, and try to, you know, mold it into a movie. You know, obviously, Ed and Lorraine Warren, they're not here with us anymore. Right. But you know they have case logs oh, well, of sure. that location. Sure. You know, the case logs, you know. Get that kind of stuff in there and, and then make a good movie yeah. or a documentary slash movie, you know. Something on the lines of that. Make it, you know, as true as possible. Because I think a lot of the other Amityville's, not that they sucked, they weren't bad. Um, I mean, the one copy that I have is from, I don't even know, the 70s, 80s. And um, it was decent. It wasn't bad, but um, I don't. Know. I think that's the direction they should go with it. They probably won't. They're gonna make it a little glorified crap. But, but, yeah, I, I mean. Yeah, I think uh, if they're gonna go the route, it should be something like. I mean, I don't mean to invoke his name, but how Zach Baggins did Demon House. Right. Because it was essentially there was a house, there was a demonic situation, they went in, and if you're looking at it objectively from just how it was created, that's how you would make that documentary. Interview everybody that you could potentially get to do there, and then go there and do a crazy investigation if you can, mm -hmm. um, to cap it off with. Granny might be able to do that at this house, because I believe people privately live there, or at least I know it was for sale recently. Money talks. Yeah. But money does talk. Um, and also I know just Googling Amityville film, uh, there's a couple Amityville movies. By a couple, I mean about 20. Oh, yeah. Um, and My favorite they is should just see through. Amityville, Mount Misery. <laughs> yeah, that's the good one. That's actually the best one, Amityville, Mount Misery. Um, oh, but they yeah. should just, I don't know, come up with like a new idea. You know what? I don't think that there's. <laughs> I'm okay. I'm okay with them redoing an Amityville horror movie. I mean, it is what it is. It's a it's a story that people like to hear about. It's a story people like to talk about. It's Hollywood. You're not gonna get any of those things you guys want. It's nope. just not. No, it's happen, not gonna You know. Um, but I am curious to see what the Conjuring take on that is. Yeah. Because. I, I'm personally a fan of the Conjuring film series. Right. I like those movies. Um, didn't care much for Annabelle. Annabelle Creation was excellent. Um, the Nun was eh. It was okay. Uh, the other Conjuring, the main Conjuring line, though, was really good. So really, they're really strong films. Um, so I'm curious to see what their spin on the Amityville horror is and, and how they approach that and how it ends up connecting to Conjuring 17 whenever they finally get to making that at this point. Um, these, the, the actors that are playing Ed and Lorraine Warren are probably going to be looking like them by the time they're done with these movies. Um, so, yeah, it's, it's, hey, they make money, they do good. Yeah, yeah, they yeah. cost, they cost pennies on a dollar, you know? Yeah. Like, uh, like this guy I watch online, uh, his name's John Camp, he says they make it from bus fare in some of these films, and they, they, they turn out like crazy. Yeah, so, that's crazy. Yeah, but I, I'm curious. What do you guys think? Yeah, I'm excited for it. Um, obviously, they're going to Hollywood the living daylights out of it. I just hope they get a nice balance between the Hollywood and the fact. Right. Um, like you were saying, I'm loving the, I guess, conjuring cinematic universe, yeah. if you want to call it that. At this point, it might as well be. Yeah. So I trust. 
the directors, I trust that they're going to make a good movie. I just would like to see that element of fact right. and truth sure. tied into that right. as well. Right. So. That would be nice. Yeah, yeah. What do you think, Rocco? Um... It's already 23. I mean, people just love Long Island, I guess. No, people hate Long Island. People they love like, Amityville. They like that one story. <laughs> um, like, defines our paranormal world. Uh, I'll watch it. I mean, I'll let you know then. I'll yeah. watch yeah. that. I'm not going to pay for it. I'm not going to pay for it, but I'll watch it. I'm not going to pay for it. I'll pay for it. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Watch I want to see that. It's too expensive. Uh, yeah. it's, it's, it's matinee. It's matinee time. It's Sunday morning, so you don't get creepy <laughs> scared. I was like, Tuesday at like <laughs> <a> 10 a.m. <laughs> um, what do you guys think? Are you excited about this whole new Conjuring Amityville Phil, uh, Amityville Horror Film, let us know in the comment section below. And if you haven't yet, you can give this video a like, share, and subscribe. And you can also follow us by clicking the little notification bell in the corner to know when all of our content is being uploaded to YouTube. So thank you guys very much for joining us on this latest edition of Ghost News Network. And until next time, take care guys.